When managing a wound using 3M VAC therapy, the proprietary 3M VAC granule foam dressing, which is a reticulated open cell foam, is placed directly into the wound bed. A semi-permeable drape is then used to seal the wound, provide a moist wound environment and protect the wound from external contamination. The proprietary 3M sensor track pad and tubing are then applied to the drape and provide the connection to the therapy unit. 3M sensor track technology helps provide uniform negative pressure to the wound surface. It also provides alarms when there are conditions that would impact negative pressure wound therapy. The application of uniform negative pressure when delivered by 3M VAC therapy applies mechanical forces, macro strain and micro strain that together removes exudate and infectious material, reduces edema and promotes perfusion, creating an environment conducive to the formation of granulation tissue. Macro strain is the physical response that can be seen immediately as the wound edges are drawn together, thereby ensuring that there is optimal contact between the wound bed and the 3M VAC granule foam dressing. Macro strain facilitates removal of wound exudate, which may contain inhibitors of wound healing. Removal of wound fluids assists in the reduction of edema, which facilitates the flow of blood into the wound bed, providing the oxygen and nutrients that are needed for wound healing. The biological responses are initiated as an effect of microstrain, which results from the manifolding of negative pressure across the proprietary 3M VAC granny foam dressing to the wound surface. This creates areas of cell surface strain, also called microdeformation. Tissue microdeformation at the cellular level leads to cell stretch. When cells of any kind are stretched, they are stimulated to expand, become thicker and more metabolically active. This response to cell stretching has been well documented and is clinically used. For example, when tissue expanders are applied to stimulate the formation of new skin. In vitro and in vivo studies conducted using negative pressure have shown that these activities include increased metabolic activity, fibroblast migration, cellular proliferation and extracellular matrix production. All of this activity leads to the formation of healthy granulation tissue in the wound bed and the characteristic undulations that have been seen in wounds managed with 3M VAC therapy. Over subsequent dressing changes, the granulation tissue fills the wound bed, further reducing the wound volume and preparing it for final closure by secondary or delayed primary intention.